That was a, that was a yellow yeah. card. Learn how to either sweep, submit, or scramble. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, you, right. the onus should be on the athlete because Probably it teaches it bad habits. Yeah. yeah, I used to hate that. Oh, really? It was, yeah. it was a, what was it, yellow card? Yellow yeah. card. And it's 10% of your purse. 10 percent of your purse, bro. Wow. 10 percent. And one time I got two yellow cards in one fight. What fight and was that? I don't remember which fight, but I but it wasn't even me stalling. It don't even be me stalling. And they just wanted. They just. They just always fuck with me. They always fuck with me. Japan, they tell you that during the fight, like yo, that's a yellow card. Yeah, right oh, they pull out in the fight. Oh, okay. Yeah, in the fight. fight. Oh, that's why I wasted time. And then they pull the card. The last time they gave me the yellow card was when I fought Kevin Random, and they gave they gave me a yellow card, and I was the one fight, and he was stalling. And you see, you watch the video. I'm like, uh, he, they gave it to Kevin Random. Then I'm like, yeah, it's about time. And then yeah. he gave it to me. I'm like, what the fuck? I said, all right, oh, fuck shit. that. And I went and knocked him out right after that. Like, oh, I didn't know fuck y'all fuck. Yeah. When I said that earlier, it wasn't because yeah. y'all yeah. fought. Oh, okay. R.I.P., I'm yeah. telling you, yeah. That, that, he was a real one. He, after we fought, Vanellay was supposed to be next or something. He got in the ring and, and pushed me. He got in the fight. Kevin Randleman just got knocked out, mm-hmm. ran all the way back to the ring to help me with Vanellay. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's a real one. Wait, you said R.I.P.? He's so much. Yeah, he passed years ago. He passed away. Randleman? Yeah. He had a hip replacement surgery, and then he got really unhealthy, like... There was yeah, staff at one point. Yeah, and he was yeah. taking shit. He shouldn't have taken a lot of pain pills and shit like that. Like, he lives here in Vegas. Do, you know? do we find like, out for sure what happened with Stefan? Was it suicide? Was it heart? Like, well, that's what I heard. It was just heart still. I don't know any difference. Church, yeah. but, uh, but, but Randleman was just because, like, he had a bad infection. He was like, bro, uh, his wife and my wife are friends. And so, like, we hung out sometimes. And, like, towards the end of his life, he weighed, like, 170 pounds. Like, it was like, you know, like, hey, that's Kevin Randleman. You're like, that's not Kevin Randleman, dude. Like, that's Kevin Randleman. Randleman. Aww. Yeah, and then he got a bad staff infection. I've never seen that. I know I know Kevin since got UFC twenty. No, way before that, like mm-hmm. like nine, ten, like when Coleman came in. Oh, and it was the first UFC I fought in UFC thirteen. Um, actually, I think it was the one before that twelve, and it was Augusta, Georgia, and um, we went. We we're drinking the night, and we're like, let's go to Waffle House. He's like, all right, cool, let's go to Waffle House. So we went, walked over to Waffle House, and we sat down, ordered meals. And at the time, I had nothing. I had zero. I didn't even start. I didn't even start fighting yet. I was just starting to train. And so, you got money? Like, no. You got money? He's like, no. He's like, Let's dine and ditch. I was like, all right. He's like, hold on a second. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Oh, that motherfucker! <laughs> as soon as we, as soon as he got to the door, he jetted out. I was like. Oh, shit. <laughs> I had to get up. So I was walking the thing. I took off down. We took off running. We were laughing the whole way. I think that was one of the best. But you know what? I, I think about it because it was the next time I was there and I fought and I went in there and I seen the same lady and I ended up giving her a big, big tip. And I told that girl, you know what? We came in here last year and we died in ditch and you and I apologize. She's all, you were that one. <laughs> she goes, who was that other black guy you were with? <laughs> he had blonde hair too. <laughs> Kevin's uh, a pretty unique human being. Yeah, he was awesome. Yeah, too. That's yeah, a funny story I know about Kevin Randleman. I actually no, no, not my story to tell. Mm-hmm. It. So someone at the time it was back like UFC tail and twelve whatever Randleman was fighting, and someone figured out to make a joke. They called up Dana and they called up uh, Randleman and they said you failed the drug test. You failed that was it. Tiki that did that. Is that Tiki that did it? He got. It. He got. Uh, I never knew that. That they so, don't know that. I don't think. So the story on this one. This. Yeah, so tell I, me your got me. I know what happened in the hotel room. They got me. They got Lorenzo. They got Dana. They got uh, uh, Mark Coleman. Yeah, Coleman was. Yep. Yeah, Coleman was in the so room. You heard the, 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 the Coleman one, right? So Coleman was in the room, right? And they, so then Dana and, and Joe Silver. And I'm hearing the story from Joe Silver, right? So they knock on the door, like, "Yo, what the fuck's going on?" So they open the door, and then Coleman. They say, like, they open it up, and it's like. Oh. He's high as fuck. You don't know what you don't even know what planet he's on, let alone that, that someone's called up and said he's like, well, hey man, random and failed the drug test. He's all <laughs> What? Like like who's Kevin? You know what I mean? Like he's fucking high as shit. So they walk in, they're talking to him, they just sit there and he's just like just like what are you talking about? Because they got prank called, but well, then at that moment, Randall and came running up to the room. So now he's and Randall is fucking. Oh, I'm not on steroids! Like freaking out. So Joe says he looks over and there's this monster of a man, Kevin Randall, freaking the fuck out, and he's standing at the exit of the fucking room to get the fuck out of. It. So he says he looking. He goes, I looked over at Dan. He's like, he's not very fast. I'll show you how I can run. The story on that one. So I, I was a part of. That. I wasn't a part of that. The Tiki got me too. So, calls my room, and he says, T, you need to get down here. We need to do a, video, uh, a photo shoot with you. Bring your belt. We need to get down here. And I went out late the night before, and I was, this was not part of uh, the agenda or anything. I was like, what the hell? I was like, what the fuck? Fucking UFC. So, I grabbed my belt walking down, and 
Lorenzo comes walking with Frank past me. Oh, what, why the fuck do I gonna do a uh, photo shoot? He goes, I don't know. He goes, I'm going down to the cage right now. I guess there's a pipe bust and there's shit everywhere. Well, one of the guys who was from Houston um, had a, a te- or, um, Texan a- Texas accent, and he called and he said, Lorenzo, you need to get down here. We're up to our knees and shit. One of the pipes busted is right next to the octagon, and there's shit everywhere. But please get down here. Well, he called Dana and told because Caruno was on that card too. Yeah. And he said, uh, Dana, this is uh, uh, what was his name? Uh, Sakura, uh, no, uh, Kawasaki. His mm-hmm. man, Kawasaki. Yeah. Kawasaki. He's yeah. all, ah, this is uh, Kawasaki. Uh, we have big problem. So, uh, excuse me. He was, uh, this is called Uno manager. We have big problem. He goes, yeah, what's going on? Uh, Carl Uno, um, he slipped on the uh, elevator. No, 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 excuse me. The escalator. <laughs> he slipped on the escalator and hurt his knee. He goes, oh, shit. Well, then he ends up calling Joe Silva and telling um, Mark Coleman that uh, Kevin failed the drug test. Yeah. And he's all, he did? What the fuck's he doing that for? And he's like, all right, then Dana and Joe Silva went to his room. They knocked on the door, and Coleman was like, what the fuck? And he's like, how the fuck did um, Kevin fill his drug test? What the fuck is he doing? He did? He goes, yeah, you just called me. He's like, I did? What did I say? Is that how he's high as fuck? Yeah, and he's like, I did? He goes, what did I say? He goes, well, you said he fell the drug test. He's like, that fucker. And that's, when, that's when Kevin came knocking at the door. They're like, I'm not on fucking steroids. <laughs> he got all of us. He got all of us at one night. I never knew that. He got all of us yeah, at one that's, night. That sounds that's a tiki, tiki move. That sounds like tiki. 